This is the children's Sunday school lesson for April the 25th in the year 2021. It's from Joshua chapter 24. Uh, the memory verse says, Choose you this day whom you will serve. But as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. And that comes from Joshua 24, 15. Okay? So, um... After the battle of Ai and the Gibeonite thing, God's people went and conquered the land, and then they divided the land up among all of the tribes. And Caleb, do you remember there was Caleb and Joshua who went up as the first spies? They were the only ones that believed God could do it. Caleb said, give me that mountain that the giants live in. I am as strong now as I was whenever I went up there the first time. Now, I'm 85 years old, but I can still do it. And he went up there and conquered that mountain with the giants, and they gave him that land. And everybody got their homes, and everybody was settled. And Joshua told the people that lived on the other side of the river that they could go back to their homes. And so when they went back to their homes, they built an altar that looked like the altar of God on the other side. And oh, everybody else got, what are you doing with an altar? You're not going to serve other gods, are you? And they said, no, we want our kids to know that we are a part of the land of Israel, just like you are. And we want our kids to remember how God brought us across the, um, across the, the Jordan River and how God did all the miracles for us. We want them to remember about the sun standing still and the moon standing still. We want them to remember all of those stories. And so they said, that's okay. Then Joshua said, I want everybody to come together in one place and I want to talk to you. And so they did. They all came together in one big group. And he told them about Abraham and how God had told Abraham to leave his country and to just worship God. He told them about Abraham's son, Isaac, laughing boy, about Jacob and Esau. Remember whenever they, um, Jacob pretended that he was Esau that day? Talk about Joseph going to be a slave down into Egypt. He told them all of these stories over again. He told them about how they, um, the God's people were enslaved down in Egypt, and God sent Moses to get them out, and they went across the Red Sea, and how God took care of them in the wilderness. He reminded them how they had come across the Jordan River, and what he had done at Jericho, and at Ai with the big um, thunderstorm and everything. And then he said, now the problem is that some of you are still worshiping idols instead of the true God. And God needs to know if you are going to make a promise to serve him only, or if you're going to serve these stupid idols. But I'm going to tell you about me. Me and my family, this is family. Me and my family are making a choice. And that choice is to serve God. This is the memory verse. It says, but, but as for me and my house, my family, we will serve the Lord, the Lord. And that's what he said. And then he said, you guys need to decide for every person here. Are you going to worship your idols? Or are you going to worship the true God? And the people said, oh, we'll go get rid of our idols right now. We are going to worship the true God. And Joshua says, this is going to be a hard thing to do, to get rid of your idols that you've worshipped all these years. They said, oh, no, we'll get rid of them. We promise we will serve the Lord. And so he made a covenant promise between God and the people that there we're only going to have one God, the true God, and that was who they were going to worship. So um, then Joshua took a big rock and he set it up and he said, this rock, listen to your promise, and this rock will bear witness that you have chosen only to serve God. And the people did only serve God for as long as Joshua lived. He died when he was 110. 
And on Wednesday, we start the book of Judges. And that's when the people start disobeying again. Let's pray. Dear Father God, we thank you that Joshua made a good choice for his family. He said, this family, my family, my house is going to serve God. We believe that God is real. We believe God does miracles. And that is who we are going to serve with our lives. We ask, O oh Lord, that us that are watching this video, that all of us might choose the same thing. To serve only you. To worship only you. Not to worship anything else. In Jesus' name, amen. See you on Wednesday.